Hey, this is Andy Finch coming at you from death to life. As a professional snowboarder, a lot of times that lifestyle is seen as this blessed life that's just so easy and uh, has all the benefits that this world has to offer and that there's no struggles. Uh, yes, yeah, snowboarding was an amazing thing I got to be a part of, but the reality is I'm still a human being with flesh and bones that breaks and blood that's running through me that can be spilled. You see, I still get in these funks and I get down on times. And it's usually those times where I'm down and, and just down on life that I realize I'm not spending time with my father and my creator. It's also me forgetting that I have a purpose, that God has a plan for me, and that I'm a, a child of God that is loved more than any parent could ever love me, any friend could ever love me. You see, God loves so, you so much they sent the best he had to offer. That was God and man flesh. That was Jesus who came and lived the perfect life that we couldn't live. And he gave the ultimate sacrifice that we are not able to give. You see, we're not able to uh, cleanse ourselves from sin. They tried hard in the Old Testament, but they failed. So Jesus came because so, he loves us so much. I want you guys to know your true father, your true daddy, and have a relationship that goes beyond any relationship you could ever have with friends, maybe with a spouse, maybe with your parents. You see, God wants to bring you under his arm. There's even scripture that talks about bringing you under his wing like a hen and bringing little baby chicks underneath his arms. Jesus desires to protect us and to have a relationship with us. But we get so sidetracked by the world and it's trying to sell us these cars or clothes or lifestyles. But the reality is those things are all going to let us down. Just like if my life was rooted in snowboarding, it would let me down. You see, I got this busted up body now that I struggle to function sometimes with two busted up shoulders that have been reconstructed, knees. I can't do the things I used to love to. You see, this body is decaying. But Christ has promised me a body that will feel no more pain, that will not suffer anymore, that will not have sadness. We have a rich inheritance. Not only sons and daughters of the Almighty Creator, but we get inheritance. We get to rule in the kingdom of heaven one day. And we get to take part in that now. I want you guys to experience that kind of joy. And if you're not sure how to go about that, uh, Death to Life has an awesome uh, resources on their, their website where you can uh, dive in and, and be discipled, to be uh, just encouraged and know that it's not about what's right in front of us. You know, there's all kinds of evidence that there's, an, there's eternal things such as we know this, the universe keeps going. The sky just keeps going. They haven't found an end to the stars. We know that there's things that exist that we cannot see, just like the breath as I breathe, the air. I can't see it, but I know it exists, and without it, I die. And then the same thing with Jesus. You know, sometimes we can't see him, but we know of existence and what he did, and that he fulfilled over 300 prophecies. We cannot see him. We don't always know that God's right there with us. But we die without him. Just like that air. Without that air, we suffocate. Without Jesus, we suffocate. I want you guys to have life and life abundantly. Again, this is Andy Finch, Death to Life. Love you.